Well, happy Monday, Thursday, Messiah friends. Perhaps this picture looks familiar. Da Vinci's The Last Supper. Some years at Messiah, we've done a living Last Supper where there were uh, actors dressed up like Jesus or the various disciples in this picture, all 12 of them there. And uh, what do we notice that Jesus is doing? We see that there is a special meal. Jesus and his disciples on that Thursday were sharing in the Last Supper. We call it um, the Passover celebration, where they were remembering how God had freed the Israelite slaves from Egypt and uh, brought them into the promised land. And so they were celebrating and remembering that with um, wine and bread. And so think of a family celebration, a very intimate, close one, where you wouldn't have a bunch of strangers gathered, but maybe it's Thanksgiving dinner or Christmas or a birthday celebration, but something where you have just family included and that would be true of the Passover. Uh, Jews celebrated that and they didn't invite other people in, didn't include other people because it was a celebration uh, in their faith and a celebration of what God had done. And somebody that wouldn't understand that or wouldn't have been part of the background wouldn't have probably been included in that particular supper. Now take that and think about what Jesus actually did. Jesus takes bread he breaks it. He takes wine and says, this is my cup for you. And he takes this very close, intimate, family-only meal and makes it one that we still celebrate in remembrance of him today. Whenever we do communion and worship on Sunday morning, that is a reminder of this meal, of God's faithfulness and promises, and the promise that Jesus makes that when we do this in remembrance of him, he is there in with and under the bread and the wine, that we get forgiveness out of that meal, that yeah, while it's still a very intimate family meal that Christians celebrate together and celebrate our shared common faith, it's something that is now open to everybody who believes. It's something that we want to understand and do with uh, right intentions for uh, forgiveness, and, but that is open to anybody who believes and understands as we do. So he takes that closed off thing and opens it up to other people. Well, that was what Jesus was all about, flipping things, taking things and making them different to restore and bring people into God's family. And so tonight on Monday, Thursday, where we remember the Last Supper, we remember uh, the end of uh, the Passover celebration, and we remember uh, the last thing that Jesus did before he was um, betrayed and arrested. We celebrate that gift that he gave us, making us part of the family and by bringing us into that special meal. Look forward to tuning in with you tomorrow for a little bit more on our Good Friday celebration. Bye, my friends.